Hi, good evening, everyone. So today we are going to go ahead and discuss how to study microeconomics for the purpose of CUIT. Okay. But when we talk about CUIT, the pattern of this exam is very different. Bohot alag hai, as compared to IIT Jam, Gate Economics, or as compared to um, you know any other exam like ISI. Thoda sa alag pattern chalta hai. So the question is, what should we be going ahead and doing? Right? How should we study for CUIT? First thing, you can follow one of the three books. Ya to aap variant kar lo. Either you do variant completely or you do Snyder completely or you do HL Ahuja completely. If your aim is only CUT, agar aapka aim sirf CUT hai, to you can do any of these three books. I would like to highlight that it is a good idea to pick up Snyder out of the three books if you aim more than just CUT. So if you aim IIT, GATE, ISI, Ashoka, agar ye sara universities bhi aim hai, then it is a good idea, especially IIT beta. It is gaining a lot of importance slowly. So it will be a good idea to do Snyder. Better book karo, hai na? If your aim is only CUET, then it is okay. You can either do HL Ahuja or you can do Varian. Second view. Make sure that you go ahead and you read NCRT also. Sometimes some basic concepts that are taught in class 11th or 12th. Kuch aise concepts hote hain. Jo sirf class 11th, 12th mein hi badhai jate hain. So those concepts which are taught in class 11th or class 12th, you may miss out on those concepts later. So it is a good idea to ensure that you also remember to read NCRT. Third. Ab baat karte hain problem solving ki. So, when we talk about problem solving beta, the questions asked in CUET are again different from the kind of questions which will be asked in any other entrance exam. So, we can divide this in two parts. We can divide parts in two parts. One, completely theoretical. These are the kind of questions, jaysay, remember if students, if you are in the current batch with me, so you will remember that I gave you a video which said historical, chronology of utilities, of utility function. Yeah, I have a video which by the name of 100 Economist who gave what? Hana? Yeah, today itself I have posted a video which says a question dala mene aad subha, which says match the following. Hana? Usme again you need to tell ki kisne kya diya. So these are the first kind of questions which can be asked which will be match the following, give the right order, who gave what, all of these things. Jaysay for example, if I ask you that the concept of indifference curve was first given by, and I give you some option, Higgs, Marshall, Smith, Adam Smith, and so on and so forth. If I ask you the cardinal utility concept was first given by, and then I give you four options, Marshall, Higgs, Allen, again. Hmm? So questions like this, who gave what? Ye wale questions, you need to go ahead and you need to remember these. Then other kind of theoretical questions, right? Just if I ask you backward bending, price offer curve, 
is for which kind of goods? Or if I ask you that the price that, you know, for which goods substitution effect is more than income effect and they move in opposite direction. Right. Or if I ask you that the risk premium for a risk lover individual will be and I give you some options. Keep positive, negative, zero, any value, essay. Yeah. So this kind of questions, these are all theoretical questions. Yeah, completely everything related to theory. The second thing that you need to go ahead and you need to do, that is what is the practical aspect, which means the numerical kind of questions. So when we talk about the numerical questions, हाँ बेटा, तो यहाँ पर बहुत tricky नहीं, doable numerical questions can be asked. जैसे we have been doing on our weekend marathon, जो हर Saturday को जिस तरीके के questions I am practicing with you, उस तरीके के numerical questions can be asked in exam. For example, if I give you a utility function, Right. And I ask you that uh, the elasticity of demand of good X with respect to price of good Y. Money cross price elasticity I'm asking. Will be Huh? Then I will give you some options. 0, minus 1, minus 0 0.3, 4. Aisa karke kuch le hmm? This is a very simple question that I have framed. Aapko ek utility function diya hua hai. And I am asking you the cross price elasticity. Hmm? So what will you do? You know the formula of Marshallian demand. Find Marshallian demand. After finding Marshallian demand, do dx by dpy into py by x and you know what will happen. Hai this itself will give you the answer. Right? So this is one kind of question that can be asked. Essay, you may be asked, for example, you know, I give you a production function and I ask you that what is the cost minimizing uh, capital labor ratio? And I give you four options. So not very difficult, बहुत ज़्यादा difficult नहीं, but doable numerical questions can be asked in exam. Now how can you practice these kind of questions, right? So to be very frank, I haven't found any one particular book. मुझे ऐसी कोई एक book नहीं मिली, जहाँ पे एक medium level के, these are not very tough questions, a medium level of Numerical economics question can be found. I haven't really found any book as such. But what you can do is, you can do the past year papers of CUET only. And then what you can do is, you can look at JNU past year papers. Right? If you do these two, It should be enough for you to understand these kind of numericals. Okay. So this is the second aspect where you need to go ahead and you need to practice the numericals. Now, if I talk about the important topics in micro, actually, there is no topic which you should skip. Her topic ko karna bohat zyada, bohat hi zyada zaruri hai. I will not suggest skipping any topic in microeconomics. To karna kya hai na, start, start splitting. Jaysay for example, 
अगेन जो मेरे साथ बच्चे हैं यू नो दैट दिस सैटरडे वी हैव फुल सिलेबस कंज्यूमर थ्योरी टेस्ट बेस्ड फॉर सीयूटी है ना सीयूटी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन विल बी आस्ड इन दिस सैटरडे कंज्यूमर थ्योरी टेस्ट सो वॉट यू कैन डू इज यू कैन जस्ट स्प्लिट कि ठीक है आई विल फर्स्ट डू कंज्यूमर थ्योरी and i will do all questions related to consumer theory then i will pick up producer theory and i will do all questions related to producer fir uske baad hum le lenge teesra topic which will be market in market you will do market structure you will do monopoly perfect competition monopolistic oligopoly monopsony ye sab kar liya then you will go ahead and you will do general equilibrium and you will do game theory and you will do the imperfect information and so this is how you can go ahead and you can split your entire microeconomics after every topic you do jab aapne pura consumer theory pad liya it is suggested that you go back to the past year papers and you do all questions of the past year paper then when you go to producer theory you do all past year papers and so on and so forth hai na har hafte mein ek do din lekar us topic se related uske numericals karo that is suggested that is what we are doing also right every saturday we are doing 15 to 15 numericals on a topic जब हम वो न्यूमेरिकल्स करते हैं दैट काइंड ऑफ हेल्प्स अस टू ग्रास्प थिंग्स उससे हमें एक कॉन्फिडेंस आता है राइट एंड व्हेन वी गेन द कॉन्फिडेंस वी आर एबल टू गो हेड एंड गेट गुड स्कोर इन द एग्जाम ठीक है सो दिस इज मोर और लेस द स्ट्रेटजी दैट कैन बी फॉलोड फॉर माइक्रो इकोनॉमिक्स इज इट क्लियर ओके बेटा ऑल द वेरी बेस्ट थैंक यू